Hey, Craig! The uniforms have just arrived. The kids are already in them. And everyone's gonna be so excited if the kids show up at that sociable. Uh, yeah. Oh, by the way, I got most of the dough. Tommy helped me collect it. Keep the kids together at least. <laughs> Pretending there's a practice over at the lumber yard. Nice, Marsh. Um, go get the rig. Oh, I got it. Well, uh, what time does the freight leave? 9.40 from the junction. Oh, well, it's not even 8.30 yet. Look, you want a turtle wardle around here and get yourself caught in a bunny trap? You go ahead. But me? All right, Marsh. I'll meet you at the hotel in plenty of time. Miss Marion, you're late. But you said 15 minutes. Oh, I meant you're about uh, 26 years late. Took you all this time to get to the footbridge with the fella. If you want to know the truth, it was almost longer. Oh? Halfway here, I nearly turned back. I suppose I'm not the first to realize it's easier to think clearly when not under the spell of your salesmanship. Now, Miss Marion, surely you don't think I've been selling you anything. No. You've given me something. And that's why I decided to come. I, I don't recall giving Yes, you. you have. Something beautiful. That's why I came and I'm glad. Please, don't think that I expect much more. One can't expect a traveling salesman to stay put. I know there have been many ports of call and there will be many more. But that is no reason for me not to be grateful for what you will have left behind for me. Um, Miss Marion. There were bells on the hill, but I never heard them ringing. No, I never heard them at all till there was you. Of things you don't know about me. Psst. Hey, Greg! Excuse me. I'm expecting a cable from Hector Berlioz. This could be it. So, who's the salesman? Sounds like she's selling and you're buying. You nuts! I didn't know I was gonna be able to leave tonight. Besides, I had to keep her off balance, didn't I? Yeah, she's so far off balance you can't tell her from a cat boat in a hurricane. Listen, Buster Brown. I climbed the ranks in the skirmish and I'm not resigning without my commission. Well, you can't get anywhere from town here by the footbridge. 
And there's a place over at Madison Picnic Park that makes this footbridge look like the old lady's home. Now beat it. Go get the rig. <clears throat> um, <laughs> never a peaceful moment in the music business. Uh, now then, where were we? You were about to tell me what I don't know about you. Yes, well, um, we don't have to get into that just now. No, not now, and not ever for that matter, Harold. The librarian hasn't felt much like doing research lately, but she did plenty when you first came here. About what? About Gary Conservatory gold medal class of Ought 5. Harold, there was no Gary Conservatory in Ought 5. Why, there certainly was. Because the town wasn't built till Ought 6. I'll see you at the show, sir. You knew all, all this time? Since July 7th, three days after you arrived, I, I tore this page out of the Indiana State Educational Journal. It was originally meant to use against you, but now I give it to you with all my heart. Well, it, if you knew, why didn't you... Why, you little... Well, a hundred and ten cornets played the air. Then I modestly took my place as the one and only bass, and I oompahed up and down the square. Good night, my someone. Good night, my love. With a hundred and ten cornets right behind. There were horns of every shape and Sweet dreams be yours, dear, if dreams there be. While a hundred and ten cornets played the air, our star is shining its brightest light. Now, good night, my someone, good night. Greg! Greg! This guy's crazy! He's going all over town spilling everything! I'll say I'm crazy! I miss my train, probably lost my job! But I got you now, Hill, and you be in the clink if weren't for that piano teacher cozying up to me. I tell all about you and what you do. Lily gags me around till I miss my train. And <laughs> no good man, hungry, Daxi Laxio. Get out of here or I'll kill you. <laughs> what? Why, you booy? You big blow off. Why, I'll stay in this town to get yours up. Down, through, and sideways. Why, you never knew the territory. Greg, here's your stuff. Let's get to the rig. Come on, hurry. <laughs> <laughs> 